Remember at the start when everyone was filled with hopes and dreams that Diablo 4 is gonna be a really good game by season 3 or 4? Yeah, wishful thinking, isn't it? We need to talk. Oh, Jesus. Morning. I'm Morning. Like making a series of videos like, let's talk about the vaults. Yeah. Let's talk about the pets. Let's talk about, you know, the Uber boss. And I was planning. Why? 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 It's a waste of time. All of it is garbage. I, there, there, I summarized Diablo 4 for you. Shit. When anyone asked me to hit level 100 yeah. in the game and max out everything so I could feel like I have a real good, solid, informed opinion on everything. Naturally. Um, but as it stands, every time I log in. Jeez, just look at him, bro. Just look at him like that's uh true. That's bad. Yeah. I, I I said it's sad. He he loves Diablo 4. It's true. He really loves that game. And it's sad because hey, everyone can relate to this, right? You you want something to be good, you really, really want it to be good, but it's just so bad. And then it gives you hope that it's gonna get better. But it gets worse. Sad. It, it, it truly is sad. It's a, it's really unlucky to be our boy. Yeah. Into uh, Diablo 4 currently. Over wait, the wait, wait. Yo, look at the hoodie. Bro. <laughs> it's the same person. Oh my god. It's the same dude. How the fuck? Oh no. It's in the Rax arc? Yeah, I know. Jesus, it's my turn? I have to get one of these hoodies. It's a max roll hoodie. What do you mean, your turn? Everyone already hates you. It's three days to live stream it. I feel like my content basically sucks. Yeah. Because I'm bored out of my mind. Right. And nothing is worse than watching a streamer who is bored out of his True. mind. Oh, it's so bad. Um, now, it's like, that's one of the worst places to be as a streamer. Is like whenever you're playing a game that you fucking hate and nobody will watch you play anything else besides that game. Like, how many- Poor baby! Literally just understood that he exists for entertainment. Hey, it is what it is. Many people, like, if you know, like, somebody, it's like, like, Tarkov, League, WoW, uh, maybe Apex. Like, it's just, ooh, it's bad. WoW is one of the worst ones. Normally, in this type of situation, yeah. I would just push past this. Right. And that was my plan anyway, was to just get to level 100, regardless of whether or not yeah, I sure. was enjoying the game. That was what I told like, myself about season two. Like, I was like, I'm going to get 100 no matter what. Like I was saying, it's not like we're solving. Dude, season two was my highest level achieved ever. 70-something, boys. Real proud, real proud I survived in that game for that long. Uh, but then it turned to shit. That's... You know, Blizzard tends to do with everything that they do. World hunger. Yeah. We're literally just reviewing video games, so it's a video game. Just play the video game. Yeah. So I think by the it end, it is a big deal. I, I will, I will trade the whole of Africa, every single soul there, for just a good season of Diablo 4. And just a season, not even a good game, just a season. Like I give a shit about the game way more than I give about the average life of a human. Hey. I will I will nuke half this goddamn planet to bits just if someone dares to hurt an animal that I like. Bruh, it's not even close. We're talking about more important issues than any any kind of starvation or whatever. Get a life, Asmund loser. Um, but I'll be honest, this is the most bored I've been with the game since the game's been out. And instead of repeating the same points I've either already said or repeated a million times, yeah. I'm basically just going to say that until a patch, hotfix, campfire chat, or season four itemization, literally anything where I feel like there's a reason to log in and do something except... Bruh. I can't wait until we get the camp, uh, emergency campfire chat where the Blizzard devs are like, Okay, we hear your complaints, we understand them. Now, here's a lesbian or two telling about how much they love being a lesbian. Enjoy. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Run with this, in my opinion, dead well, content. Here's really, here's where I'm at, right? Is like, here's why I didn't play season three. 
There are two reasons why I didn't play season three. This is the first reason, and this is the second reason. Oh, actually, no, there's three reasons. I'm hold I'm saving it for last epoch. I want my ARPG degeneracy big. to be as raw and fresh and primal as possible whenever that game comes out. And I want to be ready to go in. That's the real reason. And so, yeah, like, I just... There's, like, no burning desire for me to play Diablo 4 right now. Because, like, also, like, with PoE, here's, like, another thing. Is that whenever I watch people play Diablo 4, it doesn't look cool in the same way that watching people play PoE looks cool. Ah, it kind of depends. Watching PoE is, like... Watching a spastic kid with a, a ADHD just exist. Kind of kind of lame also, though. Like, I don't know. Like, the whirlwind barbarian thing I thought was really cool. And so I did it. And then the ball sorcerer thing I thought was really cool. So I did it. But there's nothing else in the game that I think is cool. Whereas, like, in PoE, there's just, like, so much that you can do. Like, I think next league, I'm going to play... I'm going to go back. I'm going to play Minions again. I think it's time to come back. And I haven't for a long time. Probably since... Uh, I, I don't I don't know, like... Uh, R Ritual... No, no. The one after Ritual League. Uh, the fucking Ultimatum League. I, I haven't played it since then. And so... Minion buff confirmed. Yeah, Chris DM'd me about it. And... Uh, like, But, like, I, I, I get excited for just that content vaults where you literally ignore everything in it and just go straight to the end bro you said you're gonna play season three multiple times i did i said i was gonna play it and i didn't because i'm like i would rather just play something else no yeah that's fine that's fine yeah it's okay i i, I did like i'm sorry if i misled people i am but Why? like i just <laughs> whatever right I realized this day one, and that just mm -hmm. seems like dead content to me, and the pet sucks. So, I just don't what see are you a doing? reason to log yeah, in. Yeah, like, what are you doing? However, for? Yeah, exactly. what I do think makes for entertaining streams and entertaining content is when you do something. Again, the worst part about Diablo 4 is season 3 is the fact that, man, it was so visible that this is going to be the outcome. It, it was so visible that that is going to be the outcome. It's just insane. It, it is literally insane. Also, you know what we actually need to do in Diablo 4? What I wish the devs should, uh, would try? It's that every zone doesn't just show you all the objectives when, uh, when, when you have finished the campaign and whatnot. That every zone just doesn't uh, show you, oh, here's where a corpse blah 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 is. That every zone just uh, shows you a summary of what's currently happening in the zone. And then you go to the zone and you just ride around at random. And then you see events popping up. And that's how you do things. That would be cool, in my opinion. That you could not see, uh, you know, just see. That you picked a random place and then you looked for events. That could be cool. That could be cool. Something you actually think is fun. Yeah. So. Oh, and dude, the Diablo 4 dungeons need a complete redesign. Dude, I, I don't want to go into a crypt and go through a straight line. Why, why can't we have like waves of enemies? Legion events need to be redesigned. So they, they're more streamlined, not, not just like... the Legion events are so, so pitifully annoying, honestly. Because think about how they are structured. The Legion event starts. You need to wait. You, you, you And you're AFK for five minutes. It starts. There's two groups of mobs that appear. And, well, there's no elites there. Or there's maybe one, one elite there. And, like, five mobs. That is just lame. That is just annoying. And then you kill them and, you know, go do the next two. And sometimes the totems spawn that have a lot of HP and they don't really do anything and they're just annoying. And then the bosses spawn that summon three totems that don't do anything and have a lot of HP and they're just annoying. 
and there's downtime between them. There is so much that you could improve. But Blizzard's not doing any of it. Like, if... Uh, not a single Diablo 4 season will save the game or even come close to saving the game as long as they don't make the base game good. So they need to redesign dungeons, redesign uh, how, 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 people, uh, how people go through the open world, redesign all of their material acquisitions pretty much, redesign Legion events, redesign world boss events. Like, dude, if you get, for example, if you get a group of four people in your party, or just, just let the Legion event instance you, and start the Legion event faster, not wait like five or how many ever minutes of AFK until it starts. It would be so much better. You know? Redesign all of that. Make more basic skills. Make basic skills that are currently unusable usable. Make every skill have good AoE. Because there's literally no point in having a skill that doesn't have good AoE. And... That... What's... <sighs> Diablo 4 will never even be re even remotely good unless the base game is good. And the base game is not good. The Diablo 4 dev team is so shit and sad that they will never make the base game good. Because they're constant... They, they probably think that the base game is fundamentally amazing or something delusional like that. And they think that it's just the seasonal content that's bad. No. It's the base game that's still atrociously horrible. There are unusable skills in the game. That's what I'm going to do today. I'm sure there are a million other people who are bored of the season currently. And if you're one of the people who are enjoying the season, I am happy for you. No and that's, hate. that's another big thing is like if you are, you know, a dad with three wives, 12 kids and six jobs. And you love Diablo 4. Congratulations. You're playing a game that's fun for you. Sad. You're not, um, it, I, and this isn't like a patronizing, oh yeah, like monkeys love bananas because they're too stupid to use computers. Like you, idiot, stupid Diablo 4 player. No, that's not what I'm saying. I, I, I just mm, think that I really, am, though. I am. If you like the game, you're having fun, good. But that's not me. I, it's, that's really all there is to it. That's but not most people. There at all. Enjoy your season. For me, I can't play this, and I can't make content that I feel like is good content to put out at the moment. It's like, what do you so do? So I'm simply yeah. not going to play it until there is a reason to play it, which is more than likely season four. I have seen a lot of people asking me my opinion on faith in the devs or what the devs could do. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to... Zero faith. I have to have faith in the developers. I don't want to have to make this... This is not a religion. I don't want to have... This is not a cult. That's that's not what anyone means when they say they want to have uh, faith in the devs or do you have faith in the devs? Uh, no one actually means that, idiot. I don't want to have faith in them. Like, is the game good? It, it's still bad? Okay, I'll be back. Like, okay. It's ready when it's ready. And sometimes maybe that's never. You know, uh -huh. it's like Diablo 3 started to get good around season 28. Okay? So we're like uh, one eighth of the way there. Or a bit more than that. Sorry. And all that. Uh, you know, okay, well, how about some suggestions to fix it? I don't care about sending suggestions. Uh, just... I don't get paid to fix the game. I get paid to cover it, yeah. review it, and give guides and tips on it. I could try to write 15 essays, and I've seen plenty of other people go out there and do that and send the feedback, and then have that feedback drastically get ignored, and then the next season that comes well, the, out. The is crazy like... thing is that whenever everybody, every single player is giving the same feedback, and Blizzard's like, if only we could... <laughs> no. We just wish somebody would fucking tell us about this. So we found out that you guys don't like farming Renown. Yeah, it took six months to figure this out, but we know now. We value your feedback. Yeah, well, they didn't say how much they value it. Like, for example, like, I, there's a value that I would attach to, like, a dead 
like a dead roach in my kitchen. Like there is a value there. That value is nothing. So I do value the dead roach, but I value it at zero. Literally worse than, in my opinion, preseason, because at mm -hmm. least preseason, the game was new. And now we're doing sure. the same thing. Season so, didn't even make it to the preseason. In, in, in my personal Ooh, take, I had fun in season two. I did. I enjoyed my entire one week of playing the game. And true. Same. Yeah. I was looking forward to playing season three. I just watched some people playing it. It seemed like it, it just seemed limp. It seemed limp. It seemed flaccid to me. I don't know. I like his girlfriend's cock, but okay. I don't even care to give feedback at this point. Yeah. So it's limp, good man. luck fixing the game. I hope it becomes <laughs> better. I am not interested in being part of. It's so sad that like he just. It, it, you know what's so sad? Like this is the worst thing a game to, can have, is like you know that a game still has hope, and it still have passion whenever this video is forty seven minutes long and it's him mad the whole time. But like him, it's like I I don't I don't know just fucking I I got I. I I... True, true, true. I didn't watch the video, but I actually saw it. It's a, uh, this is a four minute long video. I need to move on with my life. Yeah, this is like an actual breakup. Like, it's like, fuck. I need to fix the game, and I'm not interested currently in playing this season. I will try it in the next season when it comes out. Yeah, it's with the apathy, dude. said, I'm going to play a game today that I think will be fun, which is Power World, and there I'm probably going to make a completely fresh start wow. and try it hardcore. Well, anyway, that's pretty much it, I guess. It is what it is, idiot. Anyway, this was Quizzer Sensei. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. If you haven't already, have a nice day. Bye-bye.